What's going on guys, Broken Habits here, and we are back with, um, I guess episode part 25, um, of Life is Strange. We are now starting episode 5. So, um, Chloe died, oh my god, that's, that's kind of the first thing I have to mention. She died from a headshot. I wonder what will happen. I'm seriously I'm curious. I've never seen anything on part 5. I've only seen the trailer. I know it came out a while ago, about two months ago, but still, I'm ready. I'm ready to play it. So, guys, uh, I really want to see how the story ends. So, this is the last episode. It's been a long series, and we're about to end it. So, we just did uh, episode 4, Dark Room. Then we're going to do episode 5, Polarized. So, uh, yep. Alright. Um, without further ado, I guess I'll start it. Continue. Previously on Life is Strange. Whoa! The what did you find? Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. We can't trust anybody except each other. You know more about her than me. No, you and Chloe think you know more than anybody, like all teenagers. Oh, look, the Wonder Twins. What are you doing in my dorm? You are Damn. so fucking dead! Ah. Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. <sighs> Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. What are you doing here, Mac? Victoria has to be next. What a lame gimmick. Rachel, why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. Hard part to watch here. Uh, yeah, that's her. Rachel, why? I'm sorry, Chloe. I'm so sorry. I know you're close to Nathan, but your life is in serious danger. Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Oh god, Max, look. She's still there. Oh! No! Chloe! Look how- What the fuck? Damn. I was shocked when I saw this. Honestly, I was not expecting him to be... the villain, <laughs> or whatever. All right, let's go. Life story. Let's go, buddy. Let's see how this ends. This is honestly one of the best, uh, best story games, like, episode, episodic games, definitely. Oh, shit. Hey, look at those graphics on the fingernails. Oh, look at that. That reminds me. <laughs> what the freak put this on high? I don't know the game looks like crap. Polarized. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
crazy. Okay, we're tied up. <clears throat> <sighs> now what? Chloe. That was her first what? time. Some duct tape. These straps are hurt. Of course. And right in front of me. Oh shit. That's me. He took that shot last night. God. I don't remember anything that happened. This must be the same drug Nathan used on Kate. Uh, no, no, uh, Finally. I'm free. Almost. Use those legs, girl. Honestly, it doesn't look that bad. I hate looking at myself like that. You'll pay for this, Jefferson. I promised I would never go back in time like this again. But this is the only way. Word. Oh, we're doing this. Wait, I got it. Yeah, but how? If she's if she's unconscious, she's just gonna wake like go back in time unconscious. It makes no sense. Oh, that's great. Oh, Max. Should take a picture of Chloe. This angle highlights your purity, see? The slightly unconscious model is often the most open and honest. No vanity or posing, just pure expression. This guy's a freaking... Christ, look at that perfect face. Hold that stare there! Stay still! Because a psychopath. Oh, Max! You fucked up my shot! But please don't worry. We have all the time in the world. For now. I knew you were special the second I saw your first selfie. Yes. I still hate that word. But I love the purity of your own image. Not like Rachel, who was always looking in the wrong places. Poor Rachel. Wait. Oh. Control disconnected. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Let me try this angle. Let me just unplug it. There you go. Don't move! <sighs> Much. Thanks, Max. If only Nathan could see this setup. He tried so hard. But you can't just throw a few subjects around and expect a cohesive style or theme. But he had an eye for shadows and an eye for a whole lot more, as his elite family will find out, along with Arcadia Bay. This guy's weird. Nice. Oh, good. Oh, those eyes. It's just too bad you're so goddamn nosy, Max. But this room is under 24-7 surveillance, so all I had to do was text you from Nathan's phone. And you fell right into my hands. You really should have focused on schoolwork, not private detecting with your little friend. Chloe. Chloe, right. Yeah, I'm sorry that I killed 
that Nathan killed her in self-defense. But she had a troubled history like most Arcadia Bay dropouts. Nobody will be surprised or care. Though I promise, people will care when you die tonight, Max. I wasn't lying when I said you have a gift. Okay. Now this looks good. Maybe a few more close-ups. Max, please do not move so much. I need you posed and framed my way. Maybe a new dose will calm you oh, down. No. No. Damn. You gotta escape. Oh now my don't god. Move or this will hurt much. Stupid bitch! You just don't listen, do you? In fact, you never did hear much in my class. If you had, you might have seen all this coming. God damn, you are a fighter, though. I've had my eye on you, and I've noticed that you've been more fearless this week than maybe your whole life. No. Remember my number one rule. Always oh. take oh. the shot. Back in time didn't do nothing. Oh, Jesus. I can't believe that happened. So sick. Now what? What'd you change? back in time now what we gotta look at some oh, I'm definitely more awake in this photo I could try this one yeah do this one this might work please work I'm getting some spectacular images here, Max. Yes, Victoria would kill to be in your place, but she doesn't understand our connection. You're the winner, Max. I choose you, your portrait. Fuck you. You're trying too hard. I know you're scared. You all have the same doe-eyed look when you wake up here, replaced by fear as you realize what's about to happen. Mr. Jefferson, why are you doing this? Oh, Max, I'm so glad you asked that question. Uh, simply put, I'm obsessed with the idea of capturing that moment innocence evolves into corruption. That shift from black to white to gray and beyond. Most models are cynical. They lose that naivete. However, some Blackwell students carry their hope and optimism with them like an aura and those lucky few become my models okay my subjects yes you're a psychopath like i said and this is your last session au contraire max i'm so sane that nobody knows what's happening to you right now and don't get me started on your late partner i had enough of those faux punk sluts in my seattle days you killed Chloe. You killed Chloe. You murdered my best friend. She had a loaded weapon. This was clearly self-defense, but that's what happens when you play with guns. Or try to fuck with me. It's better when they don't know. Like pure, sweet Kate. Artists don't kill. Blah, blah, blah. God, I hate your voice now. You might as well savor it, considering it's the last you'll hear. Oh. 
<laughs> that struck a nerve. Your face changed color. Beautiful. You will not get away with this. I want you to know that. Too bad you already made a convincing argument against Nathan in the principal's office. Thank you so much for setting him up for me. I do know that the Prescotts are going to have a major scandal when the town finds out what their elite son has been doing for homework. He... he's as sick as you. He's as sick as you. Don't judge people, Max. But that's why Nathan never should have been at Blackwell. You didn't care, and that makes two. You didn't care about him. Well, you're wrong again. He was genuinely talented, and his father is a serious asshole, as you might know. I know. I became a sort of father figure for Nathan. It happens often in teacher-student relationships. It was kind of touching for a while. Did you tell him everything about your plans at Blackwell? Don't be stupid, Max. I told him what he needed to hear. In return, I had access to the Prescott fortune. Who do you think paid for this glorious darkroom and equipment? How else could I get all these hip new drugs for my subjects? Rachel Amber was your victim, not your subject. Oh. Rachel Amber. Hmm. That's the real tragedy. Nathan thought he could be an artist like me. Instead, the dumbass gave her an overdose. Chloe. Chloe and Rachel. You killed both of them. They're fucking together in heaven right now. What? Is that what you want to hear? Why? 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 Start listening to me, you dumb cunt. I'm sorry, Max. <laughs> that was not cool. Anyway, Rachel is dead. But no tears. Los Angeles would have killed her anyway, so look at this as a favor. You're evil. Oh, I see. You and your friends almost beat Nathan to death. See, we're not so different. Yes, yes we are. I cared more about Nathan than you did. No, you didn't. It's just too bad that he fell in lust with Rachel. He actually thought he could mimic what I do with the camera and subject, like father, but not like son. Where is Nathan now? Dead and buried. After what he did to Rachel, I knew I couldn't keep him as a protege for much longer. Now the police will never find his body. Do you finally get it now, Max? Wow, killed him too, wow. I can't compromise my vision with amateurs. This dude is You are freaking... an amateur. Look at the trail of death you left behind. You can't blame all this on Nathan. I don't care what you do to me. You're gonna die, motherfucker. For Chloe and Rachel mm. and everybody else. Let them know. I do love your spirit, Max, but you brought yourself here by your own choice. Anyway, I like my models to be seen and not heard. So I have to make sure there's nothing left behind of you. Okay. Now, let's see how these shots came out. I can see why your instant camera is so appealing. You don't need a computer to print your workout. What can I do? I have all those photos in my diary. This could be a way out. Oh, now this one. Hmm. This is purity personified. Maybe I can mention the journal. Uh, he doesn't know about my power, so. Oh, so appealing. You don't need a computer to print your workout. Alone. Okay. Wait, please, uh, Mr. Jefferson. Max, I would love to talk shop, but I really need to go over these pictures, especially while they're fresh in my mind. I think our session was a career high for me. Show me the photos, my diary. You... You still have my diary. Don't worry. Nobody's going to read it. Thanks for reminding me. There's nothing more innocent than a teenager's diary. 
Wait, is there anything in there? Look at your selfies. What a waste of talent. Look at that shot, Max. You can do so much better. Haha, <laughs> bitch. Gotcha. When did she take this? I'm not sure. Anyway. <laughs> guys, we're going to end the part right there. Thank you guys for watching episode part 24, 25. I can't remember. But anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next part. Make sure to like and subscribe, and peace out.